Yo, what's going on everybody? It is your boy Dina Hype coming back to you guys with a brand new video and I hope you guys are having a great day so far. And today's video you guys are going to be seeing is we're going to be covering some information about a new map coming into Call of Duty Black Ops 4 multiplayer. This was released by Treyarch themselves on their Instagram page and their Twitter page as well as Call of Duty Twitter page and the Call of Duty Instagram page. All four basically were leaking this at once. So we're going to be covering the information that was released in there and I have an article that kind of summarizes everything that's happening. So as we go on through this video, let me know what you guys think in the comments. And if you guys go on to enjoy the video, do not forget to hit that like button. It's always much appreciated if you do so. And remember to subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new to the channel. Now in this video, I'm going to be putting a picture up on screen right now if you guys do not know what I'm talking about with that tweet. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, here's the like kind of summarize of the pictures of the video. If you guys want to check out the video in full, link is in the description on their Twitter page. You guys can check it out down there. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into the information. Now starting off, if you guys want to go ahead and head down into the description down where it says information or info, you guys will see a link down there. You guys can click on that. It'll take you guys over to a website with all the information that I'm going to be reading off of. So if you guys want to read it by yourself, you guys can do that. Or if you guys want to read along with me, it's up to you guys. So starting off here, the title will say Treyarch drops teaser for a new Black Ops 4 multiplayer map. Now it says here, with the release of the next Black Ops 4 operation on the horizon, Treyarch have released a new teaser, this time hinting at the next multiplayer map. It says the Black Ops 4 operation Absolute Zero began back in December and is set to come to an end with the upcoming 1.13 update. The next operation hasn't yet been named, but Treyarch have been already been hard at work dropping various teasers for the content it will bring. Following the first teaser released on February 11th, that focus on new additions to those to the blackout maps. Treyarch have now turned their sights to multiplayer with their latest tease. The seven second video posted to the official Call of Duty Twitter account shows off the new map that takes place outside of the LAPD headquarters. Now, as I said, I'm going to put the picture back up on screen. I put it up earlier in the video. I'll put it back up on screen right now, kind of like fading through the video so you guys can kind of see what's happening. But in the tweet, it just says to support and defend. I'll also put the tweet link in the description or the link to the tweet in the description down at the very bottom. So if you guys want to watch that, you guys can. But it says here, this teaser looks to be to fall perfectly in line with a previous leak that detailed both of us or both of the new maps that were on the way soon. According to the leak, the map is called Station and is set at an LAPD police station in the middle of the city. No information was given for the other map that was leaked casino but with a full week left until the anticipated February 19th release of the maps there is still plenty of time for the new teasers now I have a video on the whole LAPD station map uh, I'll probably find the video I'm not gonna put it in the description but I'll put an annotation now if I remember or if I can find which video I put that information in so if I can find that video the annotation will be in the top right part of the screen but moving on here, it says the maps will go live for PlayStation 4 players first with the Xbox One and PC players releases set for the following week. Much like the first Black Ops Pass drop, the latest one is also expected to contain at least one new Zombies map and Black Ops character. In addition to the Black Ops Pass content and new operation, Black Ops 4 fans are anxiously awaiting the release of League Play, which was set to be on its way in mid-February. Now, that is all for that article. Now, from what I would say, from like everything that's going to be coming here in the future, I would say this. February 19th, this is what's going to come out. League Play is going to be out on that day. They're probably waiting here a couple days to actually like, say something about it, or maybe they'll just surprise us that day. Station, that will be out. That is confirmed now. It, I firmly believe that map is going to be out in the game on that day. And then... Casino, I feel like they're probably going to wait a couple of days here also to kind of say something about the map. Maybe they'll wait until like the 16th or the 17th to kind of like drop something so we have a few days to kind of talk about it. And then with the whole blackout map details, they're also going to go ahead and just, they've kind of released everything they have to say about what's going on with blackout. So we kind of know everything that's going to be coming within that. So they're going to just wait till February 19th to actually drop all that information. But other than that, that's kind of all the information that I have for you guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Remember, if you guys did go on to enjoy this video, do not forget to hit that like button. It's always much appreciated if you do so. 
if you guys could not tell in the background of the gameplay this is the new arms death match team death match type of playlist it's actually pretty fun i mean it's basically just team deathmatch but all you do is just every kill instead of getting 100 points you get 150 points so whenever trying to get like those high score streaks it'll take like not as much time to basically get there i said this in the previous video that i made or the previous call of duty video that i made basically like it it's, when you're going for uav it's 550 points now it'll be 150 300 450 and then 600 it'll be four kills and you usually have it before now it was before it was like six kills to get a uav now it's only four kills and you guys will see here on like my gameplay i'm able to get like a mantis a strike team everything so quickly without any problems because i'm getting like so many points from this 150 and every all of your score streaks even like a vision pulse that's like double the points it's a very cool i guess you could say playlist that you guys can try out if you guys are a tdm player give it a try but other than that that's going to do it for today's video. Remember, if you guys want to follow me on any of my social medias, they're all down in the description. As well as my sponsors, links to everything, as well as the codes are down there. So get yourself cool stuff. Everything is in the description. And if you guys want to check out my merchandise, if you guys want to rep the brand, it's not required for you guys to purchase anything. It's just there if you guys want to rep the brand. But other than that, remember, if you guys enjoyed, click that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And yeah, it's been your boy Dean Hype. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great day. Peace.